What's up guys? I'm Tage. The Beach. And we're Hot Fire MTG. Yes, we are. This is a new project for us. We're just getting started producing magic uh, content, uh, getting to know people in the magic community. Uh, we're really excited to share our knowledge uh, and our passion for this game. Oh man, this is gonna be great. So basically, I got back into magic in uh, Theros Block. Um, you know, like, you couldn't put it down at that point. Terrible block, but whatever. It was like 50 <laughs> Shades of Magic. You were just like, oh, tell me more. So, tell me more, um, tell me more. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Go on. Uh, so anyway, uh, yeah, I got into it and couldn't put it down. So here we are, like five, six years later. Uh, I was playing back in the day of Visions, Mirage, uh, when Ice Age Block came out. Um, and then I so, became a teenager, discovered girls, and, you know, illicit uh, recreational things. Yeah. Uh, so. so I missed all that. Unfortunately, I had a terrible, <laughs> terrible deprived childhood. Yeah. I never got to play Magic when I was a kid. Um, I played this other crappy uh, Star Trek card game, and I have a hell of a ton of those cards sitting at home, and they're literally worth nothing. I feel bad for I you. regret my life choices. They were terrible. <laughs> so I've only been playing Magic since about 2017. Uh, I first uh, set I played with was Kaladesh. I popped my Magic Cherry at the Aether Revolt yeah, pre-release. Yeah, you did. I was so nervous <laughs> playing in my first pre-release. I did terribly. But I've learned so much since then, um, and I know there's tons of other new players getting into the game these days, and I'm really excited to share a lot of the stuff I've learned as a new player with all of you guys. Really excited. Absolutely, and <clears throat> let's touch on that for one second here in the introduction. Um, just because you're a new player doesn't mean you can't go out to your local pre-release or Friday Night Magic. Just get out like, there. Yeah, just get out there. Like The communities are usually really great, 100%. and everyone's going to support you, help you out throughout those games. Uh, you're going to find a great group of people there that you're going to actually, yeah, you'll find a yeah. lot of friends there too, you know, like people that you didn't necessarily would run into in any other situation in life. So yeah, it's just a little segue. Yeah, that yeah. was, yeah. So that was one thing I noticed. Absolutely. When I started playing, everybody was super supportive. People are willing to help you out. Who cares if you're slow playing, you know, like the person you're playing with, they'll, they'll give you, a, they'll, they're not, they're going to give you advice and they're not going to, you know, they're not going to screw you over. Everybody's really been really friendly. Um, you, you just got to get out there and, and give it a try and, and you'll have a good time. For sure. So, so what do we want to do on this channel? Yeah. Let's talk about that, Matt. Let's talk about that. So some of the stuff we want to do on this channel, we want to bring you guys magic content from, from a Canadian perspective. So a lot of the big YouTubers out there, they're American, um, which is great. We love our American friends. Um, but we want to give you guys perspective from the Canadian market, right? Especially like, you know, finances. Absolutely. Pricing. So I Box work for, openings. I work for a bank. Um, I, I, I love finance stuff. I like tracking trends in the marketplace. I'm a spreadsheet guy. I'm going to share some of the spreadsheets I'm working on with you guys. This guy's the magic expert. He's been, he's been playing modern for years, standard for years. I have not popped my modern cherry yet. I have not gotten into that yet. I will eventually, and I'll share that experience with you guys. I've always been super intimidated by that. But some of the other stuff we want to bring you guys. So yeah, so we want to do some box openings on the video. Obviously, we want to do lots of boxes. Yeah. Content. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah, no, we want to sit down. We want to do some spoiler stuff with you guys up and coming, especially Modern Horizons Definitely. is on the horizon. Everybody uses that joke. Oh, Sorry. Man. Yeah. Yeah. Dad joke. <laughs> Slap it to you guys. So, uh, but you know, apart from that, we also want to maybe get into some uh, uh, Magic Arena content. Um, definitely some budget decks, things like that. Make it so that, you know, the, the, the average Magic player that doesn't have a large wallet can get into this game. So we want to bring you a lot of budget content too. Um, SBMDT, you're awesome for doing exactly that. So yeah, no, we want to kind of do that too with the Canadian side of things. Yeah, that's one thing that definitely intimidated me at the start was was just the cost of, get, of getting into this game. You know, I've only Man. recently started buying some sealed product because I'm like... This stuff is crazy expensive, but uh, we're going to talk a little bit about that. I've been more confident getting into that lately. Some of it's really good to invest in, so we're going to talk about some of the stuff we invest in, some of the stuff we collect, some of the older stuff we buy, some things to watch out for if you're looking to get into that. You know, you, there's a lot of opportunities you need to take advantage of, um, and what to watch out for if you're buying stuff on YouTube or on uh, on eBay. You know, because uh, you know there's a lot of scammers out there, right? Yeah, it can be a little volatile. Yeah. Also. We want to bring up Great Guardian Games here, okay? Absolutely. Um, big shout out to Great Guardian Games, uh, Peterborough uh, LGS. Uh, and you know what? The only reason that uh, this whole pet project of ours is possible. Again, both of us, this is not a full-time job for us. We mm. both have full-time jobs. So this is our downtime. We're doing this as a pet project. 
So one thing I want to say to you guys is like, this is our downtime. Come hang out with us on our downtime when you have downtime. Spend your downtime with us yeah. on our downtime. Yeah. Yeah. Have a good time. Yeah. Hang out. Thanks, guys. Shoot the crap and uh, yeah, some good Canadian jokes to come. And uh, <laughs>